Welcome back everyone to Asian's Let's Play of the Cat Lady on El Tari's YouTube channel where we last left off. We had awoken from our death sleep in this weird building where Dr. X has been practicing his artistic talents on innocent young women turning their corpses into likenesses of famous paintings such as the Mona Lisa, Woman with an Ermine and Girl with a Pearl Earring just to name a few. And the Venus I think was the other one. Anyway, we are going to make short work of him. Unfortunately, we uh, when I stopped the last recording and started this one, pressing the recording button actually progressed the dialogue. Uh, basically, all it said was something to the effect of the Doctor being someone who thought that she was dead and he didn't realize that she was going to be coming back to life. So now she's like, well, it looks like you just made a big mistake, you arrogant asshole. Your body, an instrument. Was he feeling her I up? I never thought you had it in you. And yet you make every fiber in my body tremble with excitement. You're gross. Your body will forever be admired by those like me who understand the only pure and true form of art. No. Stop dancing, I want to kill you. You're a dickhead. You need to die right now. I've seen enough. The doctor must die. I wouldn't stand a chance. He'd just kill me again. I need a weapon. I've got one. Looks like the killer's tools of murder will contribute to his own death. <laughs> I look like... Oh, that's so funny. I look like a tribal person. You'll feel a sharp scratch. What's up, Doc? Do you believe in karma? See you in hell. Say nothing. So, I'm just going to say nothing. Oh, right through the neck. Dickhead. He finally got what he deserved. I hope he rots in hell. Let's help this lady. I've just saved this girl's life, but why do I still feel so angry? Come on, you'll be alright. Thank you. Thank you so much. No, it's not the same girl. He would have... He would have killed me. Like the others. The animal. You, you gave him what he deserved. Cat Lady. My name is Susan Ashworth. They call me the Cat Lady. It doesn't matter. I forget you. So I'm gonna do it. They call me the Cat Lady. Now get out of here. Call the police. What if they think that I'm she did going it? home. Okay, so we just finished chapter two. Yay! So I guess there's seven chapters in total. River. Hmm. Oh. What a beautiful Standing setting. Standing by the river, I wonder. Do I need a stone? Again. No. My heart is heavy enough. It will drag me down for sure. No! Why Why you keep wanting to kill yourself? Seriously. This must be a flashback because she's wearing a dress. Like, I don't remember Susan wearing a dress. So I guess this is her home. Finally, I'm back home. What? First of all, I should wash off all the horrible memories of this night. I did not push the button then. It went to... It did it by itself. I'm dying for a shower. Something to eat. Some coffee. A cigarette. I'd love to see my cats too. 
Let's just pretend for a minute that everything is back to normal. I survived, after all. Maybe now I can try to enjoy little things in life. Alright, let's do that. Okay, yeah, I can do this. One step at a time. Take a shower. Alright, let's do that. I can't take a shower in the dark. Oh, why? I do. It's therapeutic. Okay. There we go. This Perfect. What? What happened? Great. I must have run out of money on the electric meter. I can't take a shower in the dark. I must get the electricity back on. There should be some money in my bedroom. Oh, what? Oh. Is this even a real thing? Okay, let's try not to have a breakdown. Yeah, is that a real thing? Like, does it really... Um... Do apartments in England really have, like, electric meters that you have to put coins in? I'm pretty sure her bedroom's over here. In a bag? There's some loose change inside. I better take it. Alright. What's this? What? Bills, 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 and more bills. How can I afford to pay these? I wish I'd never got out of that hospital alive. Don't worry about it, Susan. Let's just take one day at a time like you said you were going to. Okay, let's go put the money in the meter like we said we were going to do. And get our electricity back on. And then we'll worry about the bills later. Oh my god! The fu oh. <laughs> it was just a shadow. Oh my god, my thing keeps going up. Stop it. I don't want to have a breakdown. Where's the meter? Is that it there? Again, guys, in, as in the previous episode, there are people moving about the house, so if there is background noise, I do apologise, but today's the only day I have that I can record. Um, it's an old electric meter. Instead of paying monthly bills, you simply put coins in the slot to credit the meter. There's no more credit left in, on it at the moment. Okay, we know. That should last for a few days. Should be for a few days. If I remember to switch the lights off when I leave the room. Right, let's go have a shower. Come on. Blue Gorge goes up when Susan is happy and satisfied. When it fills up, she'll be able to relax and get some rest. Okay, let's do that before we end up going insane. Enter. Turn on light switch. And let's take a shower because we need to wash this blood off us because it is gross. And we can have a coffee and some cigarettes and we'll be all fine. You'll be okay, Susan. Why is this mirror crooked? I, any, any, time, any time I see something crooked like that, I just want to fix it. Why are we doing this Standing again? Standing by the river, I smile. Will I miss it all? No. I'll be glad to leave it behind. Yeah, this has to be a flashback. Come back. She, I guess she's just reminiscing on the past, maybe? Okay. That feels better. Now I should grab some food. When was the last time I ate? I'm starving. Get some food, have a coffee and a cigarette. Okay. Well, we'll go to the kitchen and hopefully there'll be some food in there. Oh, shit. Sorry, Susan. Let's turn the light off so we don't waste power. And let's go into the kitchen. Turn the light on. Okay, what do we have here? Cupboard. What's in the fridge? Cheeseburger, milk. Okay, let's take the cheeseburger and the I milk. I need a mug of coffee first. Fine. Can we heat the... 
It's a 800 watt microwave oven. Is that what it said? Let's put the burger in the oven. Shit, I didn't read the instructions. I think it was 90 seconds. If it wasn't 90 seconds, then we're probably going to have a breakdown. What the fuck? Did I just... I just blew up the cheeseburger, didn't I? This stupid thing just exploded. Why? It cooked for too long. It's completely burnt. I can't eat that. Oh no, was I only supposed to put but it that's in for 60 fine. seconds? I've lost my appetite anyway. Fuck, we're gonna have I'll a breakdown. I'll settle for some coffee. I'm dying for a cigarette too. Shit. Wait. A uh, box of matches, tinned cat food, coffee friend drink, white. I should make a coffee first. Corks I don't need it right now. All right. I need an empty mug. Well, let's fill it up first. And then maybe we can, like, set it to boil and go find a mug somewhere. Please don't have a breakdown. Okay, where is the mug? In the cabinet? An old cabinet where I keep books, mail, magazines, and wine glasses. I can't remember the last time I used these. Something, something. Pushed it too fast again. Why is that picture colored? It's got flowers. Wait. Balcony? Mug. Alright, so we can make some coffee now. Hopefully there's room to make a little bit of an error. Because we have made... I think we need two more things to go wrong. And then we're probably going to end up... I should boil some water. Okay, let's go switch on. I can't survive without my morning coffee. Well, I can, but I just don't like to make a coffee. We need to put some milk. It's nearly done, but I don't drink black coffee. Well, neither do I. Hopefully the milk's not off. Oh, That's for worse. God's sake. This milk's off. It's completely ruined my coffee. Oh, no. Why it does. Shit like this always happened to me. Was I supposed to use the one in the cupboard? I down the sink and start again. I'm going to go... I'm going to have a breakdown, aren't I? I think I had some coffee whitener somewhere. That's going to push me up. Fuck. Stupid. Why didn't you check the use by date? Okay, well, I can't make any more mistakes because one more and I'm... She's going to go insane. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Alright, let's switch it on. Why do you stand away from the kettle? It's not like it's going to blow up or something. Alright. Do you not have sugar in your coffee? Okay. There we now go. Now it's a perfect mug of coffee. Where is it? Mm. 
It tastes great. It can only taste better with the cigarette. Okay, well, I guess let's go to the balcony because we don't want to smoke inside. It's this damn bird again. Go away! Shoo! These are for my cats. I always put the food out for them once they're here. I'm not... I'm not going to be able to have my coffee, am I? This bird keeps staring at me with this evil eye. Could it be the same bird I saw in the woods? I must get rid of it. I can't relax while it's here. Oh, really, Susan? Really? Vents, light switch, spare bedroom, bedroom door, closet door. The stand ball falls off the shelf every time I open the door. I should just get rid of it. Shit, we're so close to having a breakdown. It's not funny. Paintings, bed, cut clock. No. Need... I'm pretty sure if I find something to hang over the top of the ball... Is it... No. Just some clothes and shoes. I don't need any of these. Okay. Maybe we can go put the ball on the thing out here. I used to hang my clothes here to dry when the weather was good. It's broken now, like everything else in this damn flat. Alright, so put the... That won't scare the bird off, but there's got to be something else here. There. And maybe we'll just check the spare room as well. Oops, no, I don't want to do that. I want to put the hat on top of it. Oh, I'm like, what's happening? Why isn't it changing screens? Alright, I think maybe the spare room might have... As soon as I go in here, I'm going to have a breakdown though, aren't I? I thought I'd put it away. Damn thing. I wish it had just disappeared. But here it is, reminding me of the past. It's okay... Alright, let's hang the shirt on the... Okay, good, she didn't have a breakdown, thank god. Let's hang the shirt on... I think I've gotten further than what um, Chaotic Monkey did. Chaotic Monkey had already had a breakdown before this happened, I'm pretty sure. That should scare the bird away. Shoot! That's right. And don't ever come back, you horrible creature. Ha! Miss Scarecrow here is going to guard this home from the likes of you. That's right. Anyway, guys, this has been Astin on Eltari's YouTube channel, taking you on a Let's Play of the Cat Lady. When we return, we'll have our coffee and cigarette, and hopefully that will calm Susan down enough to be able to relax. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this episode, feel free to like, subscribe, comment, and share, as it helps me out immensely. Thanks for watching again, and I will see you in the next episode. Cheers!